There are new developments in the ongoing Jimmy Haslam scandal. The Browns owner, for the first time today, admits that hundreds of trucking companies were shortchanged following allegations they were cheated in a fuel rebate program. Haslam is speaking at a trucking industry conference in Indianapolis today. Chief Investigator Ron Regan was there when Haslam revealed how many companies so far have been affected. Cleveland Browns owner Jimmy Haslam admitted in Indianapolis this morning that at least 250 companies have been affected in some way in the FBI investigation into cheating at his company. It looks like, and we're three weeks into our investigation, that approximately 250 of those manual rebate companies had had some type of adjustment. That doesn't mean it was wrong, but it looks to us like some adjustments were made to the benefit of our company and to the detriment of the trucking company. So let's say the number is 250, and if you're good at math, 250 on the base of 5,000 is about 5% 5 of our customers. No excuse if it was one customer, it's inexcusable, but it appears that's the base that we're working with. Jimmy Haslam spoke to about 500 trucking company executives. The conference was sponsored by one of the nation's largest law firms specializing in trucking industry issues. Haslam again insisted he knew nothing of the alleged cheating. There are several suggestions in the federal affidavit that you personally were aware of, of the scheme to underpay rebates to some of your customers. Were you aware and did you participate in any way? Yeah, absolutely not. I will say that again, absolutely not, okay? I take responsibility for what happens at PFJ as the guy at the top of the shop, at the shop, but I was absolutely not aware of any of this. And I think it's important to state that, state that on record in front of our customers. And Haslam told me he is in constant communication with the NFL regarding the FBI investigation and he does not believe it will affect the ownership of the Cleveland Browns. In Indianapolis, I'm Chief Investigator Ron Regan.